today we have a new series for you guys it is a road to glory like I promised and from the comment from Mr. Baggy awesome 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 comment that gave me such a big idea to do a road to glory on League One maybe I haven't seen too many on League One's I always see a lot on Barclays Premier League and English Leagues and Spanish League so I, I thought to go for League One which is a little different and also just to a quick notice that the pro clubs uh, series may be just ending because there's a lot of editing to do and uh, me and Lewis get caught up with school and also we 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 don't play together anymore so we don't I don't have the time to you know to edit and everything but anyway let's just get into the series and here we get the starter pack and we actually are surprised because we got a quite far strike with 76 pace there on the right and here I'm trying to change it around to get the maximum chemistry and this is a quick tip for you guys if you're starting up a road to glory if you just start up an account literally discard the shittest players you have even if it gives you a little amount of coins a little amount of coins are always useful then we go straight into a match and this series it is a road to glory where I firstly have to make a league one team bronze and make it a rare bronze then I have to make a league one team silver and then make it a rare silver then the same with gold I have no objective I don't win the league or anything or the division but here we are and now here is the first game of the series and here we show some Tecarito with these bronze players great pass here to Bonfigli this Argentinian beast I, I really like the strikers we got in the star pack, so you guys will see in the later episodes why, because these guys are actually quite good. And so that was the first goal, and here, it was a corner, very bad corner, but then he clears it horribly, so I just put it on here to lay it off with a left-footed half volley. Look at that for a finish for a bronze star pack player. That's a great finish. Putter Hill, uh, I think that's how you pronounce it, and that was a great finish. And so that's how the first half ended. It was 2-0 to us. Uh, I didn't show the team at the beginning, it was an accident. I couldn't find the gameplay, but he only had really a star pack team with one gold striker. It was a really crap team. But as you can see here, we were just owning the game, 61 possession. And so we were really in control of the game, doing really good football here. And then Atron plays such a beautiful through ball for Bonfigli. And know what's going to happen? It's going to be the Tequerito finish. First, first post OP. Near post, really, not first post. But then this happened. The guy stopped playing and. Yeah, he rage quitted because people that's what people do nowadays, just, just rage quit. So the man rage quitted and it gave us the win and well, 3 0 anyway. And it saved us some time. And I did buy the coin booster to get us some more coins and that was three points to us. And then we go shopping <laughs> for a right back firstly just to get boost our chemistry up and I go for five, four five one. Uh, for this um, series guys and then we pick up this goalkeeper which I think is going to be the best bronze, bronze goalkeeper we can get pretty nice solid stats 64 overall there's a 69 reflexes and then I just wanted to go get a centre back just to pop up my defence and just to get a chemistry up chemistry is very important guys so I was just looking for the most pacey one and the cheapest one of course and this guy actually is pretty decent people really underestimate uh, center backs with uh, less pace because they think they're not going to be able to catch them but they are actually because they're if they have good defense stats they will be solid and here's the team that we have at the moment I'm just going to change that uh, left back to uh, the Argentinian guy which has 75 pace he's actually really good and it's a it's a pretty pretty well shitty team of course but a good team just to start off just to boost the chemistry up here just trying to boost the chemistry up we still have this a uh, French guy. I tried to place him here, but it would not work, so we have to keep him in the bench for now. So, we're going to go into the second game with this team. And Division 5 is quite easy, so I'll just try and play for the Division 5, Division 4, and Division 3, because then Division 2 and Division 1 are very sweaty. That's when I'll probably start playing cups or not. We'll just see how it goes. As I said, I have no objective to win a cup or a league. I just, my objective is to make the teams. Um, so, here we go. We're straight away, we go into a game. And we play this guy, which I think he must have been a Chelsea fan because all his good players are Chelsea, are from Chelsea. He only has two bronze players there. No, he reaches 79 chemistry due to Chelsea players, but no one really likes the formation. So here we go, a little bit of Tecadito, and then here we do get a little bit lucky, but Atram showing the 76 pace. He really seems much faster than that, but they're just showing the great, great, great commitment for going for the ball. But this game was full of EABS, just absolute bullshit in this game. Here the guy gets a pretty lucky cross because 
Uh, I was literally all over this guy, and he had three shots, and that equaled his goals. Uh, but here, Atram got tried some little dribbling, got pretty lucky there. A little bad defence, I must admit, the goals were pretty lucky. But Von Feigley does not miss that. Great, great finish there. He actually got a great finish. But here, this this has to I have to admit, great goal by Torres, even though it's very unrealistic, because Torres will never score this. Look at that! He can't even score an open goal. How would he score that? But that, I have to admit, it was a great finish, great goal. And I put my hands down, it was a good goal. And so we ended the first half 2-2. And I did have more possession at the end of that half, and I think I was uh, had my upper hand on this kid. But then I played this beautiful ball, put it to Atram, and Atram, look at this for a finish on a bronze. Brilliant finish, nice and softly down that corner, just beautifully tidy. Yeah, I think this guy is very, very underrated. Uh, he's got, he's got the pace, he's got the shot, and he's just a very physical player. But then. I thought I could hold this, hold this lead, but straight from kickoff. So I tackled him once there. He's got the ball, does little good passing. Then I tackle him again. That's two times in one play. He gets the ball again, and I tackle him once more. And that's three tackles and the tramp, and he scores. Guys, this is EABS. I tackled him three times, but I was not able to keep the ball. But anyway, that was the first episode of All Road to Glory. Please, guys, like, comment, and comment with any ideas for the series. And thanks for watching, guys, and subscribe for more.